up? It's your boy DJ Darren What's Real TV. I'm here with Emmanuel Hudson. What's happening with your boy Philip Hudson one time? Yeah. So, um, y'all here in Orlando for the first time. How do y'all like it? You know what? It's all right. It's all right. You really need to get show. Working with spoken reason, what is the next person I want to work with? Like, you know. uh, few, few, few 
your name out right there. Maybe a little mom and mom. Yeah. yeah. A little Jim Carrey. Mm-hmm. You're trying to do a big. You're trying to do a big. You know? You're trying to work with anybody that's beneficial. You know what I'm saying? Anybody that, you know, has the same goals as us, which is entertaining these people in a positive way and let them know they can, you know what I'm saying, do something other than be out in these streets doing something they ain't got no big. You know what I'm saying? Follow their dreams. Keep your dreams alive. While we on that point, you know what I'm saying? What's real TV is all about getting our youth off the streets, out of trouble. Um, that's what we do as a living. Um, what would y'all like to, what do y'all do to give back to the community? Uh, we give them truth, but in a comedic and musical kind of way, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, Ratchet Girl Anthem. It was actually, you know what I'm saying, a call out to all the people who didn't know that being Ratchet is not cool, you know what I'm saying? Uh, we also have a Stay in School campaign, you know what I'm saying? We encourage the kids to stay in school all across the nation. Like I said, man, just continue to encourage kids that, you know, you can do something positive and be successful at the same time. Fast money and all the good, you know what I'm saying? Okay, and um, what would y'all like to say to people that's want to be in y'all shoes? What would y'all do? You should definitely, definitely, 100% be yourself, right? So you can't, don't even, you can't wear my shoes, really, because you, you need to wear your own shoes. And, you know, basically just be yourself. That's the only way. Anything you do go last. And, and though it's original, you know what I'm saying? You just started something. You can't nobody else start it. I mean, you can't nobody else, you know what I'm saying? Finish. But you, you feel? Just be yourself. You guys mostly focus on relationships. What is it regarding relationships that you guys have? I think, I wouldn't necessarily say we, we focus on relationships, but it is a big part of, you know what I'm saying? Something that everybody knows about. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. I guess being in a relationship or had a crush or you know, somewhere around that ballpark. Everybody can relate to liking a female or liking a male. You know. Usually y'all know what y'all get y'all step into if, if you ever meet a ratchet female or an insecure female. They're gonna ask a lot of questions. Um, Phyllis, they wanna know are you single? Am I single? <laughs> I just be out here chilling, look, I ain't found that yet. I'm getting that old. And what would, if Father Day is coming up, right around the corner, right. what would y'all like to say all the fathers that's really taking up their time to be with a child and not even they, they, they baby mama? I, I already know what you're trying to say. And salute, you know what I'm saying? Salute to all the fathers out there. Yes, we have a new video coming on Father's Day. And you know what I'm saying? Like you said, man, just a new time of problems is actually out there trying to take care of their kids, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it might be hard, but hey, you man up when they want it, you shouldn't man up to raise a child, you feel me? So, like I said, salute. Okay, and um, uh, well, I, how would somebody book y'all? No way. It's, it's actually pretty simple. We got one, you know, if not the greatest, you know, you know, he ain't telling y'all how to. Get booked though, but I'm gonna introduce them up to the management, which is archive entertainment. Okay. So go ahead and hit them up, hit the book right, up. right? But they gotta find out how to where they can well, find them. If you let me finish, you can go on the foot up, you know what I'm saying? On the bayou, mm-hmm. you see, you see the uh, booking, you know what I'm saying? Agency, go ahead and use that number. You can also get in contact with them at archive booking, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Gmail.com. You know, it is right. You know, speaking of Twitter, you should go ahead and trail me. On Twitter at underscore kosher and as well the booking number and you know the HC is on the bio, you know. Just go ahead and check that out. If you want us to come to a city or a school or a home or anything uh-oh. near you. Anything near you. Anything no. near you. You know. You can follow check me on Twitter. That's feeling myself. That P H I L L letter N. You know what, bro? I think I seen you. Oh, and myself. Right. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah, it is. And uh, let's see. When y'all hit the stage tonight at age one, first thing y'all think about before y'all hit that stage is the first name. I think about. There ain't no thing. Alright. Oh, my. Uh, I'm sorry. Can't do that. My bad, little Phil. But for me, it ain't no thing. It's just turn up time. You know. That's all. That's they the kids, you know, we just can't get what they want. We got to. Well, I was going to say what he said. You know what I'm saying? He just beat me too. So, um, what would y'all like to say to the people that's really taking up their time to be with a child? Um, 
Do y'all see yourself in the music game? Oh, well, uh, I got him. I, I know a guy. He, he go by the name Coach. He, he, you ever heard of him, bro? No, I ain't heard of him. Bro, be spit. You be spit. Yeah, you know, actually, actually, Kosher, you know what that means? Uh, Emmanuel, which is me, you know, I, I, I not, not that I think uh, Kosher, they're like my homeboy. I mean, I mean, they really the same person. You really. know, because we got the same personality. And the same, and the same birthday. Yep. And the same mom. Dreads. They, he, he nice, man. He nice. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully, you know, he'll be in the music industry soon. You know what I'm saying? You know, still doing this positive thing, represent. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Me personally, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm willing to be used. Positively. Used? used? What you mean by used? Used, like anywhere I can, man. Anywhere I can, you know what I'm saying? Put myself, you know what I'm saying, in position to spread more positivity. But music, you know what I'm saying? And movies, and music. Things. We do it all, man. All around the table. Like so how what we what we sh what should we look to in the future for you guys? More laughs, more more good busted laughs. You yep. know what I'm saying? More smiles. You know what I'm saying? More fun. But they is wasted uh, without it, without laughing. You know what I'm saying? It ain't my quote, but it just sound nice. So if, if if you ain't never heard it before, it's gonna seem like I made it up. So I'm okay with that. But uh, yeah, it's more laughs, more entertainment. More positivity, and more meaning, more truth. So you guys like to have fun. I found this picture online. You guys, how close are you to? Well, it's it's like this. <laughs> Two people they love each other. They come together. You know what I'm saying? Two brothers. <laughs> I'm talking about parents, and they oh, and they have kids, and we just happen to be the youngest. You know what I'm saying? And through all this stuff, man. I mean, we really came closer. You know what I'm saying? I've been kicking with my big. My big brother for a long time by ourselves, you know what I'm saying? It's just been us for a little, little, little minute, you know what I'm saying? It really if brought you, us both. If you count coming out the same womb, uh, yeah. I say that pretty close, bro. That is, yeah, you know, that you that's about as close as you can get. That you, that's it. Really, yeah. though. Really. We got the same. That's like, he got my blood, like, that he got my blood, you know? So, they ain't gonna get no closer than that, bro. But now nah, we actually, you know what I'm saying, we actually do, you know what I'm saying, look out for each other, you know what I'm saying, make sure we got a good look at the end of our show. Some brothers, you know, they don't even talk to each other. You know what I'm saying, I'm just blessed to have my brother in my life. Ah. <laughs> yeah, well, for real, man, we, we, we be both, man, two years apart, man. I love it, I love it. So what school have y'all graduated? I went to four different schools, but we won't get into that. Um, graduated from Fayette County High School, and I attended Albany State University for speech and theater. You know, so if you're wondering how I can act so well, that I studied at Albany State University for speech and theater. So you're saying a good education will give somebody a good place in life? That's the only thing that's going to get you a good place in life. That, you know, the man upstairs, you know. Uh, yeah, like I said, we have to stay in school campaign. We have no other choice. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Stay in school. Speaking of speak, stay in school campaign, what what motivates y'all into doing that? I mean, what, out of all things, why did y'all go straight for the stay in school? Well, it was really, he really fell into a map because, you know what I'm saying, our, our biggest fan base, needs to say, is children. It's the children, that future. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we want to make sure we instill some type of positive message about school because the first rule of being ratchet is, you know what I'm saying, like lack of education. education. You know what I'm saying? We don't want the little babies running around being ratchet. You know what I'm saying? That's not cool. You know what I mean? I mean? The only thing I can say is, you know what I'm saying? He love the kids, you know what I'm saying? I, I love the kids, I do love the kids. They be so adorable. And you know, they the future, so I just figured, you know, that's probably the way we can get back to the kids and let them know, you know what I'm saying? You know, we gotta take the fast route. You know what I'm saying? Just stay in school, take your time, and you gonna get somebody. We just get choked up sometimes about situations, you know what I'm saying? I just let it out, really. I don't bother. Right, I'm good now. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I ain't no, you know what I'm saying? I ain't no 
Yeah. Nah, he ain't on Saturday.